Alright, so this is part 48 of my community site tutorial series. Uh, and what we're gonna start working on now is a video commenting um, uh, functionality, I guess. Um, so we're gonna click on the videos tab, and actually, I'm gonna log in first. Oops, oh no, don't go back. I typed that in wrong, sorry. Okay, so now that I'm logged in, I'm going to go to the videos page. And I'm just going to select a random video. Say this one. I'm going to scroll down and pause it as soon as it starts. Alright, so now that it's paused, uh, what we're going to do is we're going to pretty much take the exact same code from the. Uh, profile commenting, um, or the the code from the profile page um, that allows users to comment, and we're gonna put that code in here, um, right below all of this, and then make it so uh, people can comment. Uh, but first, what I'm gonna do is we're gonna have the um, profile comments open. We're gonna create a new database table called video comments. And this has one, two, three, four, five, six fields. Six. And pretty much what I'm going to do is I'm going to add all of these fields, um, except slightly different for some of them. So we have ID. Instead of profile ID, we have video ID. And then after that, we have use, whoops, user ID. And then username, comment, and date. Date, we're going to make a bar chart of 50. Comment, bar chart of 250. Username, bar chart 50. User ID, we're going to set to big int. Video ID, we're going to set to big int. And ID, we're going to set to big int. Um, the ID, we're going to make it a primary and auto increment and save. So now we have our video comments uh, table which is essentially the exact same thing as our profile table. Um, so what I'm going to do is I have the profile page and video page open here. Um, right here after we show our keywords we have this area right here um, that I've already put in spaces for and this is where we're going to have our comment section. So inside of here is where we're going to have our comment section. So in the profile page, you just want to scroll down to where we have our comment section for the profile page, which starts right here at this, um, this echo statement. And we scroll down um, to the end of this echo statement, copy it, paste it in, and should be already indented good enough. Okay. Um, so what we need to do is we need to change a couple of things. Um, our class here where we're displaying it saying users uh, profile comments, we're going to change it to our title um, comments. We're going to make it say title com comments. And then we want to scroll down where every time we have profile comments, we want to change it to video comments right there. Uh, profile ID, ID, sorry, needs to be video ID. Um, we can leave get ID the same. Um, this is inserting everything. Uh, we can leave all that the same. Uh, yep. Um, we have our email here for when a user actually comments. So we're going to keep that um, almost the same. Um, but we're going to change our message. Um, so, hello, first name, last name. User has posted a comment on your video uh, on your video titled, and I'm going to put in quotation double quotation marks here. But in front of them, let's scroll over. In front of them, I'm going to put forwards or backslashes. Um, so that means it's a special character, so it'll show up in the email. 
And then inside of there, we want to put our title. Um, the message uh, user is posted with is below. We have our comment. Click here to view user's profile. We're going to keep that link the same. Click here to view your video. We're going to change it to the video page with the ID of get ID. Uh, we're going to send it. Your comment has been added and shown above. You cannot submit the same comment twice. You cannot comment on your own video. Okay. After that, we need to change right there. Change that to video. Change this to video. Um, everything else there should be good. Uh, right here is where we're displaying all the comments. Whoops. Um, this video has no comments. Um, whoops. Um, this is taking it to, this is our, our, uh, our pagination to make it so it'll only show a certain number on each page. So we want to change both of those to video. Right here is where we're showing our form, so we need to change that to video. Um, and that should should take care of that. Um, okay, so I just opened up the CSS file. Um, we need to scroll down to where we have our profile page. We have our top and bottom um, code, our classes here, and that's for our boxes. So what we want to do is we want to copy that, uh, the top and bottom class, and scroll up to where we have our uh, our video class here, and we want this in our left column. So, oh, actually, there it is, right here. So we want to. Um, paste it into here and after that uh, we want to upload our videos page and our CSS page so after we upload those if we go back to our uh, video page here if we reload the page and pause this video um, so we now have our commenting section here um, how to make a community site part 40 and that's what we're on we're on part 40 add videos comments and this video has no comments. Let's try to post something. Um, this is a test comment. And notice that the um, our footer here is having a bit of a problem. And also, my servers have been running slow for lately for some reason, and it takes forever to submit. Um, so I'm sorry about that. Um, so we need to fix this here. So if we go to our uh, videos page, um, what the problem is is right here we're ending the comment box, but we're, we have an extra end div tag in. So I'm gonna re-upload the videos, and after we re-upload, I'm just gonna. I don't want to wait for that. So you can see it fixes. Yes, this is part forty. Um, a stop it. Um, stop talking, Nick. Um, so that fixes our problem with uh, with that. So all of our code and everything is exactly the same. So in theory, it should work, but always test. This is a test. I'm gonna click comment, and my servers are taking freaking forever to load. Um, so I'm gonna pause and wait till it's done loading, I guess. Okay. Well, my servers are just going really slow right now. Uh, so there's really nothing I can do about that. Um, so um, hopefully someone uh, someone tests it. Uh, that'd be pretty cool and see if it works for them. I don't know. My it's just not submitting anything um, for some reason. Although it'll load the pages. Okay. Well, that's uh, pretty much the video commenting. Um, so in the next video, uh, we're gonna start on sort of a posting system. Um, and it's going to be easily adaptable to where 
um, users will be able to post something, um, and in in this case, for this example, um, what you'll be able to post is, well, hopefully what you post is um, an idea for a video you want to see, or something along the lines of that. Um, then, uh, after, after a user is posted, what we're going to do is we're going to make it so other users can like or dislike um, said post, and we're going to use um, IP storage um, in the in a database table um, to make it so you can only like or dislike um, a post one time. So, yeah. Um, so yeah, that concludes.